it wouldn't be the Drift Nationals, would it? If there wasn't a bit of controversy, everyone cranking very hard to try and get the win. Oh, what a battle. This will be the last in the top eight matchup right now. Podluski to the right. Weissel and the Jesus All About Life entry to the left. And Podluski and the Team CTS entry, the car driven to the championship by Leighton Fine last year. And Corporal Christian Pickering, who drove it the year before. Podluski's in trouble here, Johnny B. Yeah, absolutely. You could see what he's tried to do. He's tried to come in really tight and shallow, and uh, and he didn't get the rear sliding as much as he's liked from that secondary skid. Uh, so uh, I think it dripped up a lot more than what he would like. Yeah, but to his credit, Weissel gooped it even worse. Unfortunately, the car straightened up enormously on Nathan. So Podluski might just survive this. The pitfall up against Jesus. It's an interesting matchup. Weissel recovered well towards the end, but this really hurt here. Podluski got it wrong coming in. The car was straight there. He can't get it to break loose. And then this is where it got really ugly for Weissel. Yeah, yeah, because you can see there, uh, Weissel, he's obviously lost a lot of speed due to Simon, but uh, mate, uh, what can he do in that sort of situation? It's hard. I love the, the uh, headlights glowing on the Podluski entry. Weissel again a bit straight. Good onboard pictures. We're looking through the window here at the pit bull through the Auto Salon S's. Geez, you can see him really working on the wheel there, can't you? And uh, that, that's obviously hard out there, but uh, look, he's trying to keep as close as he possibly can and look awesome angle from Weisel there. Much better style of drifting now that the weather is drying out a little bit. Looking again at how hard they work the wheel. Big straight from Weisel though. Just keep watching the wheel of Podluski and it's a 10 all. Well, the judges couldn't separate the two of them. And Johnny Boston, when you think about it, that's probably the way I saw it. Yeah, absolutely. Look, you know, there were plus and minuses, I think, through that whole run for both of them. And, uh, you know, that, that's, that's a fair call. So the rerun, two matchups here between the two of them to decide. He'll go through to the top four. Podluski very wide, getting the angle. Weissel, another massive straighten for Nathan. Yeah, you could see Simon like there. The, his entry was much better. He knew what he did wrong the, the, the previous time. So there he's gone out wide. He hasn't gone shallow. He's kept the angle on, kept the speed. And like when you get that right angle, I tell you what, you can end up with some enormous exit speed. And that's what's happened there. And he's ended up pulling a massive gap. Well, the pit bull is straining at the leash here. He's desperate to get through to the top four. Weissel, unfortunately, a big straighten just there. So Nathan's got his hands full here today. The judges work on a system. If you straighten up the car, if you can't maintain an aggressive sideways slide, it will hurt you in the points. How early you get that slide on, how well you maintain it, and how close you are to the apex of the corner all plays a part in it. Through the auto salon as we go. Oh, this is awesome. This is what drifting's about. Look how close these guys are running. I tell you what, Simon would be struggling to actually see Weissel well smoke there. Yeah, proximity plays a part in all this as well, Johnny Boston. Weissel, a much better second battle. Is it going to help him out? Will he survive? Podluski, really, his proximity, I think, might just help him through this because they were both pretty well folders. And the pit bull wins it. Podluski, a narrow win, 12-8. Simon, mate, what an epic run. Mate. What a man to race against. I'm serious, that is, that last battle, the best battle I've done with anybody. I've, you know, Fink's great, Weasel, I take my hat off to the guy. Honestly, I run with that guy all day long, man. All day long. How was it going from the uh, dry to wet back to dry again? <laughs> oh, how do you think? <laughs> Mate, we, we <laughs> no traction, ice to grip. We went down in tire pressures to get a grip in the wet, then the sun come out. Um, sun comes out, we're down on, like, up on our grip on our tyre pressures, it was just like this, it's chaotic. So uh, it shows the skill of our drivers, you know. Well, you've made it through the top four, good luck, and we will see you there. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, guys. Time now for the top four matchups. Luke Fink, still the man to beat, and Jake Jones and the one via from South Australia. Fairy tale weekend for Jake so far, but ooh, he's going to have to work now. Simon Podluski, the pit bull, up against Dan Mackey. Mackey's had a dream run so far, but man, he's going to have to find something spectacular to get into the final.